had some had cramps and some uh, in his hips and his legs. And, and I and, uh, actually I wasn't thinking on taking him out of the game. Kind of felt like it was necessary. Yeah, Doobie, Doobie went out there to talk to him and just kind of uh, let him catch his breath and stuff like that and kind of give him some time. And uh, but you know we got to the point there where we definitely felt like we had to take him out of the game. Maybe I didn't expect him to hit like he has this quick. But I've always, you know, like when I sit there and watch him day in and day out and practice and sometime like in spring training, the, like kind of spring he had, I always hit him. The skills there, I mean, the skills and the talents there. I mean, and, and the only thing he has to do is the more the more consistent he gets, as we talk about hitting, the more consistent he gets, the better he's getting, man. And, uh, you know, like I said, I don't like to, I like to just let, leave him alone let him go. I didn't see where DeFreyas was too fine. He was missing. And Bastardo, you know, like he was a little, he was he was more in control of his his pitches probably than DeFreyas. If if Adams was available, would you still go with the starter there? Or do you think Adams would no, be? Would probably more likely put Adams on his right hand hitters, and I just maybe had Bastardo for the top of their order. What's going on with Papelbon? He's very sick today. He was kind of he was kind of feeling that way yesterday. Today he was very sick, and we didn't have him, and we didn't have Adams because we've been pitching him.